Harry Loser on the- Oh, oh no. my god! <laughs> Who is that? Philanthropist. <laughs> Mum, oh my god. Please meet me in the castle grave. It's Hagrid! Yes! We had one mission and that was to meet Hagrid and then we're gonna stop playing. <laughs> hey! Is that fucking Hagrid? <laughs> yes, Hagrid. On a motorbike? <laughs> what? But my god, this game is cursed. I could barely tell this was Dumbledore. Is it? All the characters look. <laughs> oh my god! You're gonna do a flipendo, Harry. Weird toddler boy. <laughs> Terrifying. Like Piers Morgan as a kid. <laughs> <laughs> Actual nightmare fuel. I feel sorry for the actors who were in the film then saw this. The PS1 era was a pretty dark time, to be honest, when it came to realistic graphics. Oh, what's going on with these faces? I'm getting ahead of myself here, though. Positives first. Just approach the edge and keep pressing forwards on the- Mate, they stole this from fucking Zelda. Yeah, look at that. Look. That felt pretty good. The game is functional. It does actually play pretty decently. Flippendo! Good job, idiot. The platforming works. Poor Trey, you here. <laughs> <laughs> There's actually quite a lot of variety, you know? You've got like a little story bit. Remember me, Ron Weasley? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that face. Then you've got the wizard stuff with the flippendo. There's there just a little effort. Look, he's like, yeah, come on, the lads. Like it, like come it. on, mate. Yeah. Come on, lad. Little bit of platforming. <laughs> Boss fight. <laughs> oh my God. Right, the body proportions on this game. Flying on a broom. <laughs> well, you're fucking it up. I know. <laughs> <laughs> if you were a Harry Potter fan, I would imagine this game actually being pretty cool back in the day. Dungeon locked. Can't get into your mum's house, mate. The voice acting was pretty good for the time as well. An object that can be charmed will be marked with a... <laughs> I literally sound like my papyrus voice. Yeah. Charmed <laughs> objects can be levitated! The performers on this game are better than the actual actors in the movie. Rumoured to be the work of dark wizards. It was Dumbledore, I knew it. You know what's ironic? The voice actor for Harry in this game is better than fucking the actual acting from Daniel Radcliffe. Can't really remember the music and what that was like. <laughs> Music as well. One interesting thing about the game that I liked is that you didn't get penalized for being shit. Mayday! Mayday! No! Where's the lab, please? Well done. Oh, I thought I was gonna say, like, <laughs> you, you fucked, fucked up. up. Yeah. The game wasn't like, try again, or force you to do it again and again and again. I like Slytherin the best. Slytherin. Slytherin. Riffindor. Nah, I was gonna say wank as you watch. Wankers. I really appreciate games that do that. Oh, it's Organization 13. Oh, heartless. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, I barely played the game, so I'm sure there's way more variety and cool stuff later on in the game. Parappa the Rapper. Trying. That was good. That was good. That was good. But to be honest, the game wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Tell you what, that is not gonna get annoying, I just know it. But here we go, the negatives. Well, like I said. He looks fed up. The graphics are cursed. <laughs> oh no, it's this kid again. What do you want, Harry? Which I guess is a positive in a way, because it made us laugh lots. Is it Ron again? <laughs> <laughs> he was dumb with his life. The game was mega crazy linear, which I don't really mind, personally. That wasn't really a negative for me. Well, that's a big bean. That's, that, that could feed a whole family. I told you Harry was privileged. It wouldn't feed her. <laughs> but I did kind of feel like I wanted to explore the school a little bit more. Password? Cake. Am I going to get cancelled for that joke? When it comes to the negatives, they're pretty middling. Oh, oh no! Oh, God damn, oh, Jesus. Who the fuck's that over there? <laughs> Gimli. But I'm not here saying, you know, oh, the platform was broken and didn't work, or the music was terrible and damaged my ears. Welcome to Charms class. <laughs> to Charms <laughs> class? I had to jump up all those tables and get to Charm class. It all just worked in a decent package. Did he? <laughs> oh, time for a lesson, Potter. Let me teach you about wizard crackers. <laughs> what? Jesus what did you just wow. say? Wizard wow. crackers? This is Pierce. Oh my. This is Pierce. <laughs> but it also hasn't got enough positives for me to be like, oh yeah, it was amazing. Definitely play it. It's just really average. It's like a little mushroom from the back. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Would I recommend Harry Potter and the Poopers, whatever it was. This is it. This is it. There we go. There yeah, we go. you little shit.
If you do like Harry Potter, I think you'd actually enjoy this and find this interesting. Creativity wise, the person who takes care of plants and that is called Professor Sprout. Sprout. It's like someone who's professor, like professor of science, like Professor That's Chemical. It. So yeah, another one for the list of games that were surprisingly okay. There we go. Intuitive. Points to we got points as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just glad that we got to see Hagrid. That's all I care about. <laughs>